subscribe now that way you can stay up to date with all my latest unboxing and review videos so today is november the 29th 2022 taco tuesday yay comment below if you're gonna pick up some tacos for lunch today or maybe you already had the breakfast burrito comment below your favorite sauce whether it's the mild hot fire diablo sriracha any of that um and me, myself, uh, personally, I like the grilled stuffed burrito. If I'm going to Taco Bell for lunch, if I'm going to a Mexican restaurant, I like to get the Mexican cheese steak, the Gippy special, the white sauce, all of that. But anyway, comment below your taco, beef, chicken, or steak. Let's go. All right, so today being Tuesday, are there any sneaker releases? Yes, it's always a sneaker release whether it's Nike or any of the other brands, Jordans. Sometimes there's restocks you need to keep your eyes open for, and they usually drop at 10 o'clock. So be on the lookout for that. Uh, between Nike, Foot Locker, Finish Line, Hibbets, Champs, East Bay maybe, any of those retailers if you're trying to um, purchase some sneakers. And to find out what's releasing, you need to stay in tune with some sort of social media platform, whether it's Instagram, follow a sneaker, um, any type of sneaker provider who has a page to follow on Instagram with information for releases, Twitter, YouTube, um, Google search, maybe even Facebook, so that way you'll stay in tune and have a heads up, especially if you're seeking something that's limited or you're new to this whole sneaker culture and you want to start your own collection, or maybe you have some extra cash saved, um, holiday season, it could be a gift for a loved one. So that way you can stay in tune and don't miss out on something in particular. Um, certain shoe or colorway that may not um, present itself again this year. So now with that being said, that doesn't mean that you can't find a sneaker. You just won't be able to get it for retail. <clears throat> you probably have to pay more from a sneaker boutique, a reseller, eBay, or someone else online who is trying to make a living by uh, purchasing these sneakers, adding a few more bucks to it, and reselling them uh, to customers like that, or maybe even going to a sneaker convention or something like that. So yeah. All right. So today, normally when I'm doing when I'm unboxing sneakers. Uh, we normally unbox one, two, sometimes three pair in one video. So this time we have several just to play catch up. So go ahead and if you need to pause the video, get your favorite drink, get you a energy drink if you're over 18, <laughs> have a bang or something like that. I like the bangs, um, different flavors. I'm on the wild cherry, uh, black cherry vanilla right now. Also the key lime pie is good too. Um, or Get you some snacks. You know, get that taco we was talking about. Some nachos. Enjoy this video. So let's go through some of these sneakers. Most of these I've looked at, and hopefully one day, um, if they're not sold or um, I still have them, we can break down each one a little bit more in a separate video. <coughs> so these are a few pickups by Nike, and the first one is going to be the women's Nike. Dunk High LXX, which I just received yesterday. Um, and when we're talking sneakers, we're specifically talking about athletic shoes. Um, that can be worn casually as well. So this is going to be black, flax, fachetta, tan, and white. Black, flax, fachetta, tan, and white. Size nine in women's, which is going to convert to a seven and a half in men's. Nike box, the tangerine orange, the Nike the swoosh and white. Flip the lid, flip the paper. And the 
this is your sneaker. And this is gonna be a dunk high in women's, but as you can see with this colorway, uh, that's why they have the conversion um, size. Women's nine, men's seven and a half. Fellas can get away with uh, wearing this sneaker too, especially in the fall um, and in the winter, but sneakers are not gonna provide that type of insulation for cold snow, wintry days, unless you have some sort of thermal socks on or your insides or your outside, be aware of that. But the colors, definitely autumn-like. Um, and it's sort of have like a classic vibe because these sneakers are gonna have that premium material with the leathers. We'll start with the outsole. Flat, 1984-1985 model, the Nike Dunk High. Uh, so you're gonna have a flat outsole in black, Nike in the middle. The color blocking, black to white to the toe area in black. The toe box area, soft, but cheddar to tan is the color. We have preparations for breathability. And the medial is going to be bachata. And then a darker, smooth, I would say, um, leather or synthetic leather for the swoosh, which wraps around to the tab and also connects to the medial side, the same color blocking. Then you have your black upper towards the ankle in black. Black flat laces. Your tongue is going to be made out of a material that's like, a, I don't know, almost like a mesh. They gave a little leather treatment up top with the Nike embossed and the swoosh in brown. The interior is black. The insole is tan with Nike and the swoosh in tan. And I guess with this color blocking, why this is women's, because you have the little gold accents with the lace loop up top, this premium tan material. For you ladies out there in black jeans, black corduroys, slim fit tight, maybe a sweater, turtleneck, if you're Birkin bag to match, or if you're in school with your Nike or Jordan backpack, Break out your, um, your black iPhone 14 Pro Max with the black case, some hits of gold to match. Then you got the gold bamboo earrings with the Nike in the middle. That's what's up. But for the fellas, black jeans, go ahead and get you the cream sweater or the cream champion sweater. You should be good with that. All right, so that's the first pair of Dunks. Comment below how you feel about these. These just released. Oh, you haven't even saw them yet. <laughs> that's what's up. Coming soon to Nike. All right, next up. We got Nike Dunk Low Retro. Gray Fog, Black Wolf Gray. For me, Tangerine Orange, the White. Swoosh, just take one. Okay. Yeah, so these just arrived yesterday. All right, so these are going to be your Donk Lows. And the pictures, they look very similar to your Panda Donk Lows except um, it gives like the vibes, I would say, of my team, the Las Vegas Raiders, which we just barely secured a win in overtime against Seattle. Shout out to the Seattle Seahawks, your blue and lime green. But this is your Raiders colors, black outsole, white, black upper. Instead of your swoosh being leather, it's this Chanel black. Give it a 3D effect. We're starting to see this Chanel swoosh on several of the ducks. I think it started with the Jordan 1 Chanel white and red. 
which is fire. Don't sleep on that sneaker. Uh, if it's a women's Jordan by Nike, um, you get the Nike on the rear, stitched, embroidered, low cut dunk, gray tongue, the Nike, the swoosh going extra hard in black up top. The interior is gonna be gray. Yeah, dunk low. We also caught the restock on the pandas uh, yesterday, so they'll be shipping it on the way soon. So great color blocking, great with black jeans, with your Raiders gear if you're not a Raiders fan. Um, it's easy to match up with. Black jeans, even if early spring white jeans, get your gray joggers, your tech fleece. Yeah, so if you're saving up your cash and you got 110 bucks, you can get these, the black flat laces. These should hold you over. And it's something different. So say for instance, you can't never catch the restock on the pandas. Okay, get you a pair of these, right? Yours are a little bit different than what everyone else is wearing. But they're still fire, right? And if anybody's hating, they just nitpicking. You gotta let them know. These is different. These are the fire. About 200 other people is wearing pandas, which is cool. Black and white. It's the vibe. You got on something that sets yourself apart from the others. All right. So with this being a size 10, that's gonna convert to uh, 12 in women's. Nah, it's gonna convert to 11 and a half in women's. So for the ladies, 11 and a half. Men's, it's a size 10. And I cut these through finish line. And Nike just released them as well. And it's another colorway of these coming out too, like a dark purple uh, with similar color blocking. So keep your eyes open for that colorway as well. So, Nike Dunk High Retro SE, light smoke gray, gem red, white. I feel like you guys are gonna love this pair, I'm sure. I think I got these through, I've uh, ordered these through the finish line. Um, keep in mind, if you live somewhere where you have a mall or a finish line, call first, go by and see if some of these shoes are still sitting returned or available. If not, um, just go to finishline.com, check them out, see if there's anything in the size left <clears throat> or something similar. So I think they use our extra fire. smoke gray and these really put you in the mind of an SB dunk but this is your Nike athletic club as you can see on the tongue I think it's cool that you got the dunk embossed in the back and keep in mind these dunks originally came out in 1984 1985 but when I see this dunk on the heel embossed or sometimes when they have Nike on the back it just gives me that 90s vibe so from the bottom, light smoke gray to white, to a box, good new box suede material. Matter of fact, let's get a close up on these. All right, so once again, one thing about this is you got almost like a sweatshirt material up top on the upper for this dunk high. So that's different than having complete suede or leather. I like how the red wraps from the medial side all the way around. The little red leather pull tab. Just a smooth synthetic le leather. The highest quality parts of this sneaker is gonna be the new buck material. 
it's the white toolbox area. That leather is just synthetic, typical. So this is not really like a premium sneaker other than the new buck material. The tongue is that sweatshirt material in gray. That's unique and different. You got the flat laces in gray. But if you wanted to make them pop, you can put it in the white laces with this red crimson color. Let's see that. Gem red. Gem red. Yeah, not crimson. All right. So, yeah, sweatshirt material around the upper and on the tongue makes this sneaker unique. And that's what I'm saying. If you're constantly releasing dunks, yeah, new colorways are cool, and you get the SEs with premium materials, but the creators and the designers, uh, the craftsmanship, constantly bringing something different, you know. So, whoever the team is, it gets together and come up with these ideas for these different materials and fabrics, doing a great job in 2022. But, if you want a little bit better quality leather, if you're spending $125 plus tax throughout the shoe. I know it's not an SC, I know it's not premium on the box, but just a little bit better. But other than that, great color blocking. You got your gray tech fleece or your red tech fleece by Nike. You're good to go for this fall. Nice and warm. If you're on campus, you're good with the toboggan to match. You got the red uh, iPhone or the Samsung S22. Good to go. Full fit while you're chilling at Starbucks, getting that caffeine in, that pound cake. All right, so what do we got next? Women's dunk, high, 11 and a half in women's. Remember earlier, <clears throat> which converts to a size 10 in men's. Fossil stone, black cell, and yeah. Flip the lid. What do we have inside? Fire pepper flames. Women's Nike Dunk High Fossil Stone 2022. Mm. So, it's a similar to one that I reviewed before which would be the Oxford pink and white dunk high for women's. Or maybe it was men's, because they look identical um, as far as the style, 1984-1985 model. Dunk high, the outsole. <coughs> and it's fossil color. Got the Oxford pink sail throughout the toe box area. One thing that pops is the black swoosh around the back. Pull tab to the medial side. Just a basic clean colorway for the women. Or for the fellas, black jeans, cream pants. Good to go. All right, let's see anything else. We got Nike on the inside. Flat laces, new colorway for 2022. Comment below how you feel about these. I think the color blocking is just smooth, clean. Yeah. These retail for 125 plus tax and shipping. And we're gonna have all the titles um, in this video and also in the title area, so you can look these up. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, if you're interested, so excuse me for that. But yeah, so you got your dunk highs. Also, follow me on Instagram, IG at P.OASTMAN. Also, check out my eBay store, P.OASTMAN. Share the video with your friends and family. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying 
This we also unbox electronics, apparel, accessories, supplements. Yeah, a bunch of different things. So, shout out to all my day one YouTube subscribers. I definitely appreciate the support. So we have one more on this Nike Dunk Hall. You guys want dunks? We're good. Um, so this is going to be a women's dunk low SC, CC, Honeydew, and Phantom. So this is going to be a size 11 in women's for the men, size 9.5 in the U.S. Last but not least, oh snap, I almost forgot about these. So these were the instruments here. And I think some other, maybe Foot Locker as well. So the entire Material is almost like a towel. The entire shoe is used with towel like material. It's real soft, real comfy, very unique. I think you have the sustainable recycled materials on the outsole. Came with extra laces in the Nike sack. I would definitely install these laces to make it pop more. These will be flat laces. Well, the mint, or light green, let me see. The honeydew, like the honeydew fruit. So you got it in like the melon family. Uh, the honeydew color is light green. Uh, definitely made out of this soft towel like material throughout. With Nike. Right here on the tongue and the laces are made of the same material so you have the white leading to the dark green light green different for a dunk low if you want something unique your pops and stand out banking on the back just get you the cream tech fleece or the white tech fleece for you ladies or if you can find this honeydew color these sneakers at the next sneaker con it's gonna be lined up on sellers tables these are all 2022 releases and the inside is going to have like a different pattern on the insole with the Nike comfort level for all of these dunks you have a flat outsole no art support so it's not going to be a 2022 or even 2015 to 2022 comfort level technology. Just basic comfort, strictly a casual wear shoe. For you ladies who are sneakerheads, your shoe game is thorough. You got variety, copying everything. It's cool how you have embroidered stitching and outlining the swoosh in a darker green to make it pop. The Nike on the back is embroidered as well. The only thing is there's no preparation for airflow. But comfy at the crib, chilling or in your dorm with your friends. Still got the wow factor of fashion. This dark color, honeydew colorway. This wraps up this Nike dunk haul with a few lows, several highs. Comment which ones are your favorite. Hopefully, you enjoyed this video. A little under the weather. The sinus and allergies sore throughout all of that is crazy. But anyway. Um, 
Hopefully you're enjoying this cyber week, finding some deals online for the holiday season. Getting your Christmas tree up. Yeah. All right. Everyone stay healthy. Peace and love. videos you have all the ducks I get a good visual before I make a decision I'll purchase a new one. appreciate it P.O. Smith <laughs> What the piss, Mega Source? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>